I wanna, I wanna style. I don't like this. I don't like this uh, Romance Italy font. And I wanna background. And I wanna. I don't want blue. So how to apply style? Well, you know something about CSS. This kind of file, like HTML, but inside it, it uh, it can make style for uh, your website. So you don't need to apply a style in every every word, every letters you make, every links. Just apply the style on the whole page how to do that it's easy in Dreamweaver that's a lot of way but I like this way just go to the page properties or just right click here page properties you see here in the window page properties window appearance on it Arial the fonts the font and um, 12 size pixels and the text color on it just black and background color well for now I just make it but make it gray Later I will apply background image, but for now I will show you how it looks in the links. I want it same, but I want it bold, the same, same size, and the link color I want this to be dark red. Visit links. It means the links that you have visited so it will be just black and the roll offerings I want it a bit I want it red just right and the active link on just the same like the link color or just make it black and the others you can try the others but for now I just do this you can apply it to see I like this background color well a little bit green I will change later so now you see the font is Arial And it's turned dark red. Kind of cool, huh? And what fun in the code view? If you see code view, and you see uh, between the head tags, you see this is style type tag CSS. So. Dreamweaver automatically make CSS for you and you can learn how to make CSS from Dreamweaver body font like this ok we just make I want a picture on my body ok first you have to save a picture in Folder on your folder. All right. I just uh, save my picture. So to insert picture, you just go here, insert image, or just Control Alt I, and I have this image. I choose this image. Uh, no worries. I just 
click it Let's press ok here we go F picture first I want this to be aligned because this looks terrible let's align to the left we have here it's uh looks it's stick on the image so to change this we just go click the image and I want to have space here so I have it so here and the properties panel and you click the image we have V space, 8 space. So V space is vertical space and this horizontal space. So just it's horizontal space because we have we have no problem with this vertical space. Let's press 5. And we have space. Preview in the browser. And we see here our page hmm? and the links. It's just change when you roll over and it's roll over. Okay, it's nice, huh? Background. How's the background? The background is looks. I don't like this empty background, especially this gray. Oh man, it looks so horrible. So we go back to page properties, and I have put and the uh, pattern you click you'll see here traditional pattern it's too long man. I just change this to pattern then pattern and you see this pattern you, I choose this and I want it repeat X and Y if we click apply, we will see cool, cool background. Huh? Is, that, is that cool? And let's see on our browser. Preview in browser. Yes. You see, we have nice background. It's really nice. So I think this that's it for layout. Uh, and see you in the in the next uh, tutorial. Thank you. Bye. -bye.